Okay. <clears throat> we are on day four. And um, I'm just getting ready for the day after like a long time of not doing any makeup or hair. I decided I guess it's time. Well, the truth is I'm gonna see some of my friends, so. <laughs> and I do feel a little bit better right now. Um, anyway, day four, yesterday, was was an okay day. I did make a big uh, crock pot of chili that we can eat for the next couple or few days. So that's a step in the right direction for food, making food for Chris and I. Um, it's not a meal plan, but, but it is me making progress. So, Still have more laundry to do. Um, Emmett is sleeping right now. We're gonna go record some music at a friend's house in a little bit. But um, I uh, I wanted to record a second video yesterday, but I thought that might just be a little annoying to have multiple videos a day. Um, but yesterday was kind of rough, to be honest. I was just really tired and. When I don't have something at the middle or end of the day, then I'm kind of like, okay, if I can get this stuff done before I have to do that, then like I'm not as, I don't know, there just doesn't seem to be as much purpose during the day for me, so it gets a little bit discouraging. Plus, my brain gets a little bit weird when I'm pregnant sometimes. I took a nap and, and then I woke up and I was like, what day is it? Who am I? <laughs> okay, not who am I, but Um, so, <clears throat> I think this can feel like the spot where, like, you are tempted to just kind of let it go and stop your progress. That's what it feels like to me because, I'm like, okay, I've done better on some things, like, around the house and stuff, and now... What do I do? Like, what am I? The planning part is what I have a hard time with, and that's the whole thing that we need to change. That I want to change. We both want to change, Chris and I. By the way, Chris hasn't been on any of those videos, videos with me, and that's not on purpose. He's um, just working. So I just wanted to move ahead and keep pressing on and and uh, try to stay consistent with these videos, doing them every day. So. I think this point can feel like that point where um, you're just like, okay, now I can kind of relax on it. I don't really need a plan for food. I'll just make sure and make food every day. Like, this is that point where it's really easy to maybe give up and just kind of say we'll do it later. But it's part of what these videos are for, for me, is accountability. <laughs> so, um... Yeah, I have a busy day today. I'll be going to somebody's house to record, and then I have a chiropractor appointment, and then I have my Bible study tonight, my women's Bible study. So I don't have a ton of time to do stuff around the house, but um, yeah, I don't even I don't even have a plan to be honest with you. Um, but. You know, if you have any ideas, we're definitely, I'm open for suggestions and ideas of meal planning and, um, you know, plans to, like schedules to take care of the home. My very, one of my very best friends is amazing at cleaning and taking care of her home and I've, I've gotten some tips from her before and she's, um, really awesome and always willing to help and has even helped me clean out rooms before in our house <laughs> like big time cleaned them like I can't even believe we got so much done in one day kind of cleaned them 
Um, I definitely, I think I get intimidated sometimes by um, implementing stuff that she does because she does so much. And I'm like, oh, I can't do that. Like, it's way too much. I wouldn't be able to keep that up. Which I'm sure isn't true, but it feels like it. So, anyway, today's going to be not feel like a productive day, but I think it will feel good to kind of get out and about and take the baby and see some friends today. Um, just to kind of feel more normal rather than being around the house and feeling sick and feeling tired and looking at everything and going, oh, I should pick that up, I don't want to. <laughs> I really feel like that this is much like other things once like the beginning and the, the start is the hardest and then once it's a habit it's a habit like it's like brushing your teeth you don't dread brush you just do it like it's just every day same kind of time of day like so just kind of letting you in on my honest feelings because right now I'm feeling like I'm not really gonna figure out a plan, but I am. I am definitely going to figure it out. Um, it's kind of hard because Chris and I don't have a lot of time together right now, and he was really sweet, and he told me yesterday, he goes, hey, I have this small block of time, it's like a couple hours, he's like, but I really wanna hang out with you and son, and so how about from 2.30 to 5.30, like, which is quality time. So that's really cool because even that will help, but he's just been working really hard, which I definitely appreciate. But just, you know, for any relationship, even with him and Emmett, like we just need more quality time to feel closer or to build stuff together, you know? So we haven't really got to talk about our plans for the house and food and stuff like that because we just don't really hang out a ton right now and I go to bed early now because I'm always so so tired and don't feel good because I'm pregnant and so um it just makes for us missing each other every time so um but so today will be a day of seeing friends and um chili to eat already <laughs> and um, yeah. so day four is really not that exciting <laughs> but I appreciate you coming along for the ride with me and um, supporting and helping us through this uh, process because I don't know, you already know, like, when you start it, that not all of it is going to be, like, this cool, inspiring process. Like, sometimes it's boring like this. Sometimes it's, it's just, like, discouraging. <laughs> um, so, today's one of those days, but it is all right. Because it's still part of the process, and it's still a step, and... We're still committed to going forward, so uh, maybe next time you see me, I'll actually be wearing makeup, but maybe not. All right, happy Thursday.